Vehicles used for commercial purposes don't generate revenue when they're not operating, and fleet operators often have little tolerance for long charging times for electric vehicles. In China, battery swapping has emerged as an alternative to plug-in charging, and it's gaining popularity across light and heavy-duty commercial fleets. Because this technology is relatively unknown outside of China, let's explore how exactly battery swapping works. ICCT staff visited several private battery swapping sites for taxis and heavy-duty trucks. We saw that vehicles pull into the battery swapping stations with batteries that usually have a state of charge between 20 and 30 percent. Taxis are raised on a platform so that a robotic arm can access the vehicle chassis, where batteries are stored. In trucks, the batteries are behind the driver's cab, and a robotic arm reaches down from above. The robotic arm takes out the old batteries, puts them into storage and charging, and inserts fully charged ones into the vehicles. In as little time as two minutes for taxis and six minutes for trucks, vehicles can return to normal operations. The battery swapping station for heavy duty trucks that we visited typically houses seven batteries. Depleted batteries are charged using DC fast chargers and need about 40 minutes to get fully charged. By the time all seven batteries are swapped and the eighth vehicle comes to the station, the first swapped battery has completed recharging and can be used to swap the depleted battery of the eighth vehicle. Each station can swap 180 to 190 batteries per day. For taxis whose batteries are smaller, each swapping station typically houses 60 batteries and performs 500 to 600 swaps per day. Taxi batteries are charged at a slower speed to conserve battery life. It takes about three hours to charge one taxi battery. Battery swapping is an interesting zero emission commercial vehicle technology. To find out more about battery swapping technology and other latest research on China's zero emission commercial vehicle market, please go to the ICCT.org and follow us on LinkedIn, Twitter, and WeChat.